Rotbosher's DX is an 8-bit action puzzle game that's pretty simple to pick up on. You're a minor guy on planet Mars and you shoot up rocks, enemies, and run from point A to point B on single screen levels. Throughout the way, you also hunt for keys, deactivate turrets, and hit switches. Each level also has three collectible items, a scone, cheese, and a teacup. They sometimes can be hidden very well, and even when they're shown on screen, they can be a challenge to get to. Each level is also timed, making for an even greater challenge on what is already a difficult game. Rock boshers definitely can get tricky in some areas where enemies like zombies flood the screen endlessly. With all this stuff in the game, there's a good replay value. While Rock Boshers certainly is true to design and being an 8-bit styled game, it's really hard to appreciate it and ultimately have a fun experience. I didn't find any aspect of the game to jump out at me. I feel like it's a pretty forgettable experience when comparing it to other games in the same genre. The genre, of course, being games that are designed classically, but released presently. And while the game is tough, it's not that tough. Surprisingly, I was able to finish it. For me, I'm really bad at classic games, so if I'm able to finish one, I know from that standpoint that the game probably isn't that difficult to regular players, and difficulty is a huge point of interest for old games, so I'm not sure if this game's for everyone. I did love the music though, it's one of the coolest 8-bit soundtracks I've heard. Another aspect of the game that may bother you is since it's a ZX Spectrum-like game, it has huge borders over your device. The game was of course made this way, but it may bother some who would have appreciated at least a border background of some sort. It's not that Rock Boshers is a bad game, it's just that it's not exceptionally great in any particular way. Some may look for a more memorable experience, and if you love the difficulty of old school games, Rock Boshers may be too easy for you. But either way, it's a serviceable 8-bit action puzzle game with really good music.